What's up, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Today, we're gonna go over something from the side control position. Also, this coming Friday, myself and Nakana, around 6.30, we're gonna be going live and doing a little video chat for you all. So get some questions that you have in mind, and myself and Nakana will answer it to the best of our abilities. All right, let's start from the side control position. And I got this question on my Instagram. If you follow my Instagram, I do a little Instagram questions as well at least once every two weeks so the question was Chad can you show me a lapel choke from the side control so I'm going to show you one of my favorite things to do so when we get to the side control and I'm pressuring what I want to do is just rip the person's gi out you know I can just push here I'm staying low he's not going to be really worried about this even if I give up a little bit of space I can always go right back to the underhook right but I'm going to pass his gi to my opposite hand. One, this gives me a ton of pressure. So if I pull it to the side, I can make this miserable for Nakana. All right, just really start to drive my shoulder in, make it terrible. All right now, what I'm gonna do is pop up the neon belly, all right, because I wanna attack with this. So I can use this for a bunch of different things, but what I'm gonna do today is I'm gonna get control of his belt or his hip, I'm gonna pin it to the floor. Now, sometimes you could just pop up to the neon belly, if your partner's being aware, as soon as we go to pop up here, he might be gone. So what I'm gonna do instead is I'm gonna go up slow and I'm gonna go here with my knee to keep him pinned down. So I'm gonna go right at his chest and then I'm gonna switch to the opposite one and I wanna aim right for his ribs and his solar plex. Right now, once we get to this position, I'm gonna quickly pass and get my grip. Right, so we're here and here. Now all I'm gonna look to do is re-grab that lapel. So if I can, I'm gonna re-grab it and I'm gonna cut in. Now when we go here, the way that some people teach it is they'll drop down and they'll drop their elbow. That's fine, and the way that I do it is I just crunch everything in. All right, so either one of those. So I can drop off to the side and really cut down on the throat, or I can keep control, I can grab whatever I can grab here and my elbows are just gonna pinch in. Now, if I'm not getting the pressure that I need, right, so, one thing you might be doing is flaring your elbows out. I wanna make sure everything is in, my elbows are tucked, and I'm pulling in towards my hips here. So I wanna go like this. If it's just not working, you're pulling down, you can't get the finish. A lot of times his hands are gonna come up, he'll start to fight, which makes it easy to pop to the mount. Now we get here, a lot of times the next step is he's gonna bridge. So if I couldn't get there in time, that's fine. I just hold on to this choke and I make it extremely tight for him. And a lot of times he starts tapping. So I'm gonna give up the mount position to go to guard to continue to squeeze and pull everything in. Now, if I didn't have a tight grip and I didn't feel like I could finish it from there, then I would just stay in the mount. But again, we go here, we pass. Control up, up, pass through. We're here, as long as I have my knee, I'm not worried about him going anywhere. And if I do lose it, he pushes off, then I'm still in a solid position. But I'm here, go ahead, try to move. You can't do it, it's pretty hard, as long as I get good control. Now you're gonna chop across the neck if you can, grab the back, pull it in, keep everything tight. If you can't, here's fine as well. Pull everything in and really lift his neck off the floor. Now if he starts fighting it, we go here, I can put my head on the floor and try to finish. A lot of times he's gonna bridge and knock me off of the mount, which is fine. I keep everything in and I continue to pull and it's a really tight choke. As always, no liabilities.